Okay, hi you guys. Um, I know it's been a while since I did a video, and I'm sorry, I got incredibly busy, like you won't believe. Um, the new year hasn't been quite as kind to me as I thought it might be. But I'm here now, um, we're gonna have another couple of videos, um, because of YouTube's silly time constraints. Um, I have no idea what I was doing in the last couple of videos, so, woo! Um, it's not dark, sadly, it is about nine o'clock in the morning, if I remember correctly. And, uh, yeah, the house is pretty empty at the moment, so I figured it would be a good time to get cracking with another part of Amnesia. So, yeah, as I was saying, I've been pretty busy, there's not been many updates, and I'm sorry, um, I will try very hard to keep the updates coming more often. Um, Hopefully I'll have a little bit more time than I have had. We'll have to see. Uh, oh my goodness. Where am I? It's the fact that Daniel's already freaking out. Look, let's go into the light for a minute, Daniel. Come on. Calm down. Oh god. <laughs> ah ha, wind! <laughs> uh... Yeah, that that wasn't very fun. I come on, and then and there's wind and, and and stuff, and I'm trying to explain. Uh, what? I'm sure my sanity was not quite as bad when I was playing this earlier. Let's see. I got the wine cellar key. Oh, that's right. We needed to get the chemicals from the wine cellar, didn't we? Okay. I'm gonna sit here. Light. <sighs> light. Light. We like the light. I keep forgetting I don't need to hold down the crouch button in this game. I can just press it. Stay. And I can press it again and he will stand. Okay, there we go. Let's get cracking. Wine cellar, here we come. Um. Uh. Oh, loading is in red. <clears throat> is, that, is that good? Is that bad? I don't know. Such is praying, gazing into the dark dome ceiling. That's lovely. Where? Where's a light? So let's get the lantern out. Hmm, look at that. What a lovely place, eh? I'm already starting to regret turning this game on. This is horrible. I don't like it. Footsteps, and I'm wasting lantern oil. So. Ah! Where did the Baron go? Who cares? He left us with a wine to last us a lifetime, or at least until tomorrow. <laughs> Wonderful, and there's still sopping going on. Footsteps. Hate, hate footsteps. When I can't see people. Just... Hello. Hello. Oh my God. No, no. Stay. Stay in there. Stay in that door. Hello? Hello? Is, is anyone home? May I? 
May I come in? Huh. I can touch it. What is it? Someone walking on the ceiling, and you can like see the dust. That's creepy. Open sesame. No, this one. Definitely not. What's happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Stop. just absolutely charming isn't it so these are obviously the guys who got shut down in the wine cellar and something happened to them they they exploded I'm not really sure there's a lot of mess here isn't there remember kiddies this is why your parents tell you to not become alcoholics. Look what happens, see? Look at this mess. And look at this mess over here. Like that could be a bit of brain matter just here and that that could be a leg or an arm. Okay. And I mean look at all this look at this blood, see? Don't become alcoholics. It's not good for you. This is why you explode. Pop. That guy needs to stop walking around everywhere. Like, I mean, honestly. Oh no, there's a, there's a feather. FEATHER! Oh. I didn't actually mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that either. I meant to press the crouch button. Oops. Oh, hang on. Ah, uh, this is one of the chemicals we needed, isn't it? It's... Basket. Sorry, ready? Whee! Okay, and there's a note here, so let's read the note. <sighs> I said, let's read the note. Damn chair. Uh, if you want to read this, you might want to pause the video. That was just, um, yeah. Okay, so if you didn't pause the video to read the note and you just want a sort of brief overview, um, one of the guys who I think we read about earlier, Wilhelm or Wilhelm, I'm not sure how you'd say it, um, who was employed by Alexander to come here and kidnap people, um, he ended up locked in this wine cellar with some of his men and um, I guess the wine was poisoned or something and he was writing that note just sort of explaining what happened and he finished with saying that blood started to pour from his eyes while he was writing and then it stops because obviously he could see what he was writing and it would have been stupid to carry on writing uh, da -da -da. That's a funny clipping issue, isn't it? Okay, so we've got one of our chemicals and we've found out why people tell you that you shouldn't drink too much. That's a great start. We've got a guy poddling around on the ceiling, I guess. And we've got meat hanging from the ceiling. How wonderful. And chains rattling. Let's see. What's in here? Just 
just a, a small room. I like small rooms. Except when there seems to be someone walking. Oh my god. No, no, go away, monster. I'm gonna like this and I'm gonna wait. Guys, hear that? There was—it was like a. I must be very fluent in monster. I wonder if I could talk to him if I ever find one. It'd just be all... and maybe he'll walk away and leave me alone. What do you guys think? I can't see anything. Hello. Hello. I wish Daniel would not freak out so easily. It makes it very difficult to do anything. Okay, so... Shut up! <laughs> if an enemy is near, stand and hide in darkness. Make sure to turn off your lantern. God, don't! Oh my God, does that does that mean there's like an enemy somewhere? Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna go in that room. Stop panicking, Daniel! Oh my God! Whew! Whew. <laughs> no! Okay, I'm I'm gonna leave those rooms alone because it's like monster. I'm gonna come in this room. And there's bugs, lots of bugs. Get off my screen, please, bugs. Shoo, shoo! Look, my sanity's fine. I'm sure it is. Okay, no, my sanity's not fine. You know what? I don't care. No, <sighs> And my lantern ran out of oil and my game briefly froze. Okay, fine. Uh, ah, we need this. Come here. Ah! No, Daniel, move! Daniel! Oh, come on, that didn't even hit my head. Come on! Get, get real! Look, look, that barrel hit the table. Come on, it didn't touch me at all. <sighs> Daniel, look. Calm down. Look, see, nothing can even get in this room while we're here. Now calm down. Calm, breathe deeply. But my vision is all horrible and wobbly. A few cuts and bruises. Well, if a barrel landed on your head and you only got out of it with a few cuts and bruises, I'd be pretty impressed. Come on, Daniel. Calm down. There we go. The room's still kind of all fuzzy, but... Um... Lots of rocks. I obviously didn't need to barricade the door, the room would have done it for me. 